no wickedness on the earth. See right now, all right, uh, the, the trees, the trees are mourning, man. The trees not growing how they usually grow, right? The fishes are, are all floating up to the shore. All right, the people that walk up on the earth, all right, they are, they are not at ease, man. All right, the animals, they are locked up in the zoos. So they're stressed out. All right, and it's all because there's a wicked nation that's in the power seat right now, man. All right, read on. I, in all but, Atalakia, but ultimately, the most high God, Yahweh, he put this wicked nation in the power seat to get, to, 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 uh, to chastise us, man. Right. Because we're a wicked nation, man. The last thing we want to do is turn to the most high. We all got all kind of excuses. You got brothers that want to uh, follow after their own vain philosophies, man. You got others that's caught up into Christianity, all right, and different uh, indoctrinations or uh, religions, man, right? Everybody is trying to find their own way, but they don't want to follow after the way of the Lord, man. That's right. So we're up under these Deuteronomy curses, right? We're going to bring some out through the Spirit. Go ahead. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 15. Uh, Bring it out. But it shall come to pass if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. So if we ain't going to hearken, the results is this. Can't go grocery shopping. You won't be able to cash your check without an active shooter running up in there like a madman and killing our people, man. Right. Why they were peacefully at ease. But see, that's the problem. A lot of our people believe that we are in their rest. And we are not in our rest, man. We are in our captivity, man. That's right. Surely, yet this day, you are in your captivity, man. Right. All right. And that's what we get for this uh, regarding what the Lord had in store for us. Since you want to be a drunk, since you want to blow on cigarettes all day, since you want to lay with your neighbor's wife, all right, since you want to be a thief, a murderer, a robber, all right, and all these other things up under the uh, earth because you birthed in your lust, the most high got to repay you. So here's the recompense of it, man. Right. So here it is. We standing out here in front of Tops, all right, just a week and a half ago, an active shooter came up in there and started blade, trailblazing our people, man. Right? Go ahead. I but it shall come to pass if thou will not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. You observe to do hey, all brother, you got a second. You got a statue. Which I commend thee this day. So, you're probably wondering what we out here doing today, right? Why is there some black men, right? Some young black men out here with Bibles in their hand, with sticks, and with uh, strings hanging off their shirt. What the hell is going on, right? That's what's going through your mind, right? Right. So, really, what we out here to do, let me see the stick out. Is we trying to bring our people back to their true nationality according to the Bible, all right? Because there's a great confusion on the earth, right? And that great confusion is what? That these other nations, <clears throat> primarily, primarily the so-called white man, they have given us bywords. So if you look on this sign, they calling us these proverbs here, right? You probably will identify as an American black, right? Right, but the Bible doesn't call you American black. God called you uh, an Israelite from the tribe of Judah. You see that? But why didn't they tell us that we were Israelites from the tribe of Judah? It's because it empowered you, man. Yeah, all day. Somebody give me, um, give me Isaiah chapter 1, verse 3. Real quick. The book of Isaiah chapter 1. Three. Bring it out. The ox of his owner. See that? The ox of his owner. Read it slower, ox. Right? The ox of his owner and the ass his master's crib. And the ass his master's crib. Now these two these two animals, right? They're they're not very smart. But they can uh, identify their owner and they can identify what house they come from. But our people what? But Israel do not know. But Israel what? But Israel does not know. Israel, they don't know, right? 
Our people, they walking around here calling themselves black. Like they came out of a crayon box, man. Right? Or they'll call themselves blonde or crit. Right? And they ain't got nothing to do with nationality. Right? Read on. Nor consider. They don't even consider. We stand out here and we telling our people, look, turn back to the Lord. We God's chosen people. Right? We're put on this earth and we're obligated to follow the commandments, right? To keep the faith so we can over we can overturn this society and put the earth back at ease. But they don't want to hear that because they believe they can follow the programs of this uh, place and prosper. So this is far away from their mind. Right. Go ahead, huh? A sinful nation. A what? A, a sinful, sinful nation. nation. They're a sinful nation. The only way they feel like they can get up is if, you know, they go and sleep with the white man and get the bag and sell their soul. Or the so-called white, our, our black women, they like to uh, get the money by what? Going into a strip club? Or uh, really just working for the white man. They believe the only way they can survive is by working for their oppressor. But the Lord is getting ready to withdraw us up out of this system. And he's asking for us to gather ourselves together in these last days and to come up out of ignorance. Give me Hosea chapter four, verse six. Right? Yeah, bring it out. We gotta come up out of ignorance. Our people, they they they're satisfied in doing wickedness, man. How you satisfied with selling drugs to an elder? How are you a real nigga by killing another black girl? But see, these are certain, this is this is the stuff that the ideas they put in our mind. Right. Right? Bring it out, huh? My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. My people are what? My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. But hold on, you got Jake in college. My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. You got Jake that got all kind of degrees. Destroyed for a lack of knowledge. You got Jake in high places, but the Bible's saying that these people on this side, they're still destroyed for a lack of knowledge. What knowledge are they destroyed from? They're destroyed from their own knowledge. Right. Because when we were brought over here, we got stripped from all human characteristics. That's right. Right? What did they take from us? Your language. Right? Your God. Right. Right? Your land. Right? They stripped you from your family. You could have been a mid-aged man. They took your wife, put her on a different plantation. Took your two cubs, put them on a different plantation. That's wicked as hell, man. Right? You try to rebel, they'll castrate you, man. Right? You try to show dominance, they'll butt break you in front of your wife, man. That's how they stripped us from all human characteristics, man. They took the fight out of our people. And now our people, they lying around like an old lion, man. Right? Read on. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. And what else did they do? They that stole our inheritance. Right. We the real Jews, but yet you got this imposter, this swagger jacker, Right? In Israel and America today, walking around claiming to be the Jew. That's right. You don't see these Abraham Lincoln looking motherfuckers walking around our neighborhood, man, with these small hats, right? Who got ZZ With ZZ like that, they're acting like you. Right. You see how wicked the so called white man is? They said, no, you're not God's chosen people, we are. They put on our customs. They told you you was a nigga. You had something? Go ahead. They take everything from us, man. Our inventions, right. our nationality, right? Our language. They're over there speaking Hebrew, right. man. That's our tongue, man. Even though they're speaking the, the modern right. Hebrew, right? We, come, we, we were speaking ancient, that real shit. Mm -hmm. Right? But they twisted everything all up, man. Right? Read on. That thou shalt be no more priest to me. See, the Lord said that since we're going to be stuck in confusion and y'all want to willingly continue in ignorance, you're not going to be no priest to me no more. Right? And then now, guess what? Since we're not priests to the Lord, what happened? Now you got other people standing up claiming that they need that Islam. They don't know what that thing is about. You got brothers and sisters that want to stand up. They say that they Black Panthers. You got all these different black organizations that stands up, they, don't get me wrong, their attention is well, but their knowledge is not Right, it's not there, knowledge. right. So, so, so the word, well, really the word more just being black. Yep. Right, so that's like an a, a old school term. That's like you in, uh, in, in Europe, right, calling yourself black. That's all the word more means. 
And they were wicked Israelites. Because they once knew the law. They once knew the commandments. But they, they, so they abandoned it and wanted to make their own way. That's why they were so bright. They were scientists. They knew a lot of information. But they, they, were, they, they were into witchcraft, man. Right? Go ahead. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy God. But see, you have forgotten the law of thy God. Right. Right? And because we have forgotten the law of thy God, the most high, he put somebody in a power seat. Give me Job chapter 9, verse 24. Nah, bring it out. Right? See, Seeing that thou hast forgotten the law of thy God, uh -huh. I will also forget thy children. He goes, do what? I will You'll also, also forget, forget thy, thy children. children. So since you don't want to follow my law, statutes, and commandments, I'm going to abandon you and your children. Just like when your son and your daughter in your household and they, uh, disobeying your rules, what you do? You put their ass in the corner. And if they get too old enough, right, and he does something that's totally opposite of what you taught him, you may abandon them, man. Hey, make it your make your own way. That's like your son growing up being a homosexual. Now, they, now today, they try to make it seem like you should love them. You shouldn't do that. They got, uh, 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 they got examples like, uh, Gabriel Union, and, uh, 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 what's the truth? Wait, 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 man. Right? Oh, I'm going to love my son anyway he is, man. But the Bible tell you don't do that, man. Right? we supposed to teach our people the right way. A man's supposed to be a man, and a woman's supposed to be a woman, man. Right? We do And that's further in my, uh, Wait, we said that's further in my point. Because that's totally confusion. How the hell are you a man walking around with a dress on? Right? Yeah, I told me this week in the beginning Verse 7. As they were increased, yeah, so, they, believe so. so they sinned against me. So since they, as they increased, or it could have been a chronicles. They, what? they sinned know. against me. So as time went on, we just became worse and worse and worse. Somebody get me, they had some wax cold. Right. They, they, we just got worse and worse, man. Right. Now we got brothers and sisters that we knew that was once out here. That just hurt me to turn cold and probably turned the pistol and shot their own goddamn man. Mm -hmm. I know you know somebody that killed their own friend. Right? Because they want to follow after the wicked. Right? Give me that. Yeah. Judge at the 9, verse 24. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. They were what? They were given into the hand of the wicked. The earth was given into the hands of the wicked. That's why, right? You got uh, a lot of organ, uh, uh, a lot of organizations. They come out here, man. They making money off off of this, man. They making funding off of coming out here supporting this, man. They got something called the 501c3, man. Right? 501c3 is is, is pretty much an agreement. I know, to where, I know. My, my fault. Don't worry about it. They, Don't worry about they it. They sign a contract with the government where you tax exempt, right? And you pretty much, it's like these churches, they lay in bed with the government as long as they can't teach this truth. Right. And they can continue and not pay taxes. So when you putting money in that damn, uh, in that collection plate, it's all cash. But if they were to come in the audience as an agent and just listen and heard us talk talking this, they'll probably go to church now. Or they'll be ready. That's why they killed that, uh, that Turner. That Turner was teaching the truth, man. And he rebelled. See, we want, we're not supposed to rebel yet because vengeance is of the Lord. And that's right. what that's when he stepped out of place. But that Turner knew he was an Israelite. That's a fact. Right. 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 to give it to the hand of the wicked to cover up the faces of the judges thereof. And see that? They covered up the faces of the judges thereof. I ain't got one out here. But you know, you, you ever seen that, that Jesus? Church, that white guy with stringy hair. Yeah, on this camp, right, read that again. Yeah, we gotta go get that. The earth is given to the hand of the wicked. See, the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. Read the second part. They cover up the faces of the judges thereof. They have covered up the faces of the judges thereof. Right? They covered up the fact that Jesus, who they ignorantly called Jesus today, was a black man. Right. That's covering up the faces of the judges thereof. That's why the, that's why the Bible says that the earth was given into the hands of the wicked. Right? Give me that in, uh, where uh, Yahweh Shai was crucified in America. Is that uh, Revelation 18? 11 and 8. 11 and 8, my bad. You funny as hell. Look at Revelation. And not only in America, they deceived the whole world, man. Right? Hold on, hold on. Who got that? You got it? Let him read it. Bring that out again. Got the book of Judges 9 between 4. Read the uh, Empire, the second part. 
If not, where and who is he? No, read the judges part. They have to give it to the hands of the wicked. The earth was given it to the hands of the wicked. Not only did they cover up the faces of Yahweh Shai, which is uh, Jesus Christ, they covered up the faces of the angels. They covered up the faces of all the prophets. They covered up the faces of the whole book. Right. Everybody, when you're watching a, 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 a emblemical movie, they tell you that all the characters is white. Yeah. When the Bible is dealing with black men. That's, that's right. right. That's covering up the faces of the judges. Right. America is Babylon the Great because this is the land of confusion. That's and right. that's why they allow transgenderism, man. Right. That's right. a fact. That's Go a ahead. fact. Uh, they cover up the faces of the judges thereof. Uh huh. If not, where, where and where is he? And that's right. the so-called white man, that's the, the devil of the earth, then where and who is he? Right, right. where are you Because at? look, you got all these <laughs> other nations, they come over here and they want to dress like the white man. Right. That's why they wear a suit and tie. They abandon their whole inheritance. The whole, right. They, they, they'll be into something else over there in their own home. Yeah, that's a fact. They'll right? come over here and wear a suit and tie, man. Yeah. And try to present themselves to talk properly yeah. like the so-called white man. That's right. Because right. all these other nations that is in bed with the so-called white they man. They drunk that cup. Right, because they they're like... drunk off the cup of the wine of the wrath of America, man. That's right. And guess what? Because of that, the earth shall fall. That's right. But the earth going to... Uh, Arise again when the Lord put his prophets back in the power seat, man. Right? His elect, all right, the saints, right? Those men are going to restart the earth, but this society is going to come down. Right? Go ahead. Uh, Revelation. 1 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 9. Chapter 11 and verse 8. Bring it out. And their dead bodies shall lie in the street. And their dead the bodies shall what? Shall lie, lie in the streets. In the great city. And they dead, our dead bodies are lying in the street out here. Spiritually, man. Yeah. Our people are spiritually dead, man. That's a fact. Yo, literally, at that, at, at that, at that corner store right there, you can wake up 7, 8 o'clock in the morning, and you will see one of our elders drunk out here, man. Yeah. Smelling like piss. Yeah. Because they spiritually dead man. right why are they spiritually dead because our people are too busy trying to follow the ways of this place instead of following the ways of god man. right that's why our people are spiritually dead that's man. right Doc. everybody got the answers and everybody think they know the way man but there's only one way man there's only one way and that's the do the heavenly father you how about shimmy i was shot right and if you don't like it well we don't know what to tell you man that's right because huh? this this thing up here ain't about feelings man this thing up here is not about feelings and that's another thing that's what's wrong with our people they always reacting off of feelings i don't feel that way yeah i felt like this so i shot him i felt like this so i whooped her butt right that's how our people react off of feelings yeah man. emotions that's why our men in in jail. Yeah. All right. That's why our women at the abortion clinic. Yeah. Because it's all about feelings. Yeah. That's why they don't want to hear the truth. Because oh, that don't feel right. Why everybody can't be accepted? Why the hell ain't you accepted in America, man? Right. Right. But you worried about saving another nation? They don't give a damn about you. Look how they leave your neighborhoods, man. Right. Right. Look how they slaughter your people, man. Our people are led to the slaughter, man. That's right. Right, go ahead. And their dead bodies shall lie in the street. And our dead the bodies, city. they're lying in the street. Go ahead. Of the great city was spiritually. It's called Sodom, Sodom and Egypt. Egypt. And America is spiritually called Sodom and Egypt. That's right. Because homosexuality is accepted. Right. Back in the day, you had to be in the closet with that shit, man. Right. right. Nowadays, they pushing it on the agenda of our children. Yep. Right. Yep. They going to school. Teaching our children that it's okay to be a fucking homosexual. Man. Bring it out. The gay BC. Yeah, man. They got our kids in school putting condoms on a goddamn uh, dildo, man. Yeah. Hey, my son, 10 years old, he got three gay little boys in his class. What the hell do these kids got <laughs> anything to gotta learn? Anything? This is how you know that the so-called white man's a fucking pedophile, man. That's right. Why the hell is that even on your mind to go into a school and teach these kids these sort of kind of things, man? Right. We don't give a damn. We going to tell it how it is up here, man. Right. Right. Read on, huh? Where also our Lord was crucified. And also our Lord was crucified. Yeah, he was crucified in the Middle East, but he was spiritually crucified over here because everybody believed in uh, text, uh, Caesar Bozier, man. That's so-called white man. That is not the. That is not Jesus, right man. Here on these candles. That's why we need that sign, man. Caesar Bozier. He's all on these candles. Yeah, him right here. 
Don't pick this up the guy. candle. Just this is Caesar Bozier. Because I know everybody watching, man. Right? This is Caesar Bozier. This is not Jesus Christ. That's right. They saved him. They uh, crucified our Lord and, and replaced him with him. And now you gotta go bow down to a so-called white man. Why did they do that? Because they want you, they want all the power, man. Right. Yeah, laugh, giggle, turn red. Right? Laugh, giggle, turn red. But it's the truth, man. Uh -huh. Right? Go ahead, I Go ahead, bring your piece of ball. Bring a change, it's a string, for 15. Bring it out. Give me wisdom to say it's not from above, but it's earthly, sexual, devil. You see, they wisdom is not from above, man. They, they wisdom is earthly, sexual, and what else? Deceitful, man. It's very deceitful for you to send a shooter in there, right? And we know that you, you we know that you, you people sent that shooter they in there. They planned man. that shit, man. We ain't gonna act, I'll sit out it was there and be buddies with you, man. We yep. know that you sent that damn shooter in there to kill our people, man. Right. And then you want to come in our neighborhood and give us kisses and hugs, man. Right. right. Trying to rock but us to sleep. The Bible that a gift destroys the heart, man. Right. 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 That's why your mind want to join hand in hand with them because they give you shit like this. Food they, trucks. You think that they for you. Right. right. These people don't give a damn about you. Because if they right. did, why they kidnapping our daughters? Why is that daughter's being kidnapped? For organ harvesting? Right. For transgenderism? Right? Right. Why is guns being dropped in our neighborhood? Right. And being resold when they captured by the police? Man? That's right. What about drugs? You got lieutenants and captains that sniff more cocaine than a drug dealer, but you will lock us up for it for 10 years. Yeah, that's going, that's Let's wicked. Let's be real out here, man. Come on, come on, right, that's a Let's fact. Let's be real out here, man. Bring it out, huh? Right? What you need to do is go home and think about what the fuck you did, man. Because the Lord getting ready to repay you, man. And you can't stop the words of the Most High, man. At all. Because guess what? Everybody else had their turn. But the Lord said that he was going to raise his prophets up last. Right. In the midst right. of all of this madness. Right. You got the coronavirus going on. Right. You got, what else, what else going on, man? Monkey, Monkey pox. pox. Monkey, Monkey pox. pox, man. Famine. Right? Famine Famine, in the world. Famine, man. Killing the Come food on, throw sources. Throwing out, man. Throwing the, the uh, bombing the damn the, food the uh, companies. Crashing, man. Right. Nations against nation. Against nation. Oh, Rumors of war. Rumors against war. Give me Matthew chapter 24. Bring it out. Show y'all what the hell is going on right now, man. Bring it out. All these things are coming to pass, and y'all out here sleeping, man. Right. Sleepwalking. But we crazy, right? Back in the day when we used to come out here and teach this, right? They used to really thought we was crazy back then because we weren't really nothing going, going on. Going on. <laughs> and now you can't it's really say now. it. You can't really, you can't really disapprove it now. God, bring it How on. How you going to disapprove it when it lines up to what's going on today? Right, right. Only a fool would do that. Right. Did you right? Got it? Bring it out. 24 and verse, uh, start seven. at verse uh, Six. Nine. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Start, start at verse seven. 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 Yeah, start at in the seven. Yeah. Look at Matthew chapter 24, verse seven. Somebody give me Mark chapter 13. Somebody give me uh, 2 Ezra chapter 16. Go ahead. Uh, the book of Matthew chapter 24 verse 7. Uh-huh. When nations shall rise against nations. And nations is about to rise against nation. Guess what? China is planning on dropping over there in uh, California. Yes. Right. Did you know that? China is getting ready to invade America on the shores of California. You didn't know that, did you? Because you ain't paying attention. They ain't watching, huh? You're too busy blowing blunts. You're too busy worrying about going out on Saturday nights. Yeah. You're not watching what's coming to pass. Right? Go ahead, huh? For nations shall rise against nation, the kingdom against kingdom. And kingdom against kingdom. Go ahead. And there shall be famines and pestilences. And, and you got famine, right? They said, um, they said the world only got nine more weeks left of wheat. Right? Damn. So America's America's financing uh, Ukraine, sending what, 40 billion, 40 billion dollars over there, right. right, for what, weaponry, right, right uh, to support war, right, but what about ourselves being bare empty, right, right, this is how you know this That's is going on. Bubble, man, yeah, man, down. right, sure. go ahead, uh. and there should be famines, and pestilences, and earthquakes, and pestilences, man, right, 
Look what the hell is going on, man. Pay attention out here, man. It earthquakes. Now, five or ten years ago, you wouldn't, you wouldn't have never seen an earthquake happen in the Northeast. Now we starting to experience earthquakes over here. Yeah. Did not the Bible say that earthquakes will happen in diverse places? That's right. But you don't give a damn, huh? Long as you got a nice paying job, and you can wear your suit and tie and cut and shave your damn head, boy. Right? You good, huh? Come out, take pictures with our damn kids, and you did you did something, right? Go ahead, ah. Uh. It earthquakes in diverse places. Uh huh. All these are the beginning of sorrow. Cause all of this is just the beginning of sorrow. Now y'all see that this dude came up in here and he wet he wet tops up, man. They he killed ten of our people, man. And then they sent another man into Texas and they killed how many? 18 innocent children, man. Right. They up to the 21. 18, what is it, 21 now? They said like 21. You got to be the was damn double. They was Edomites. So be willingly. Yeah, you got to be a car. All of them was Issachar? How do you go into a school? What? Majority? Oh, okay, school. Con, con. Damn. And what's the highest grade in elementary nowadays? I think they changed it to seventh grade. So that means all of these kids had to be up under the age of 12, man. You going to go up in Texas in the elementary school and wet up a bunch of children, man? And then they, I, I believe they saying that he only be in charge for one body that was caught up in there, man. Am I right? What? Yeah, he only be in charge for yeah, one body. Right. One what? body. How? Man. And that was the security guard. How right? is that? But live streamed everything. And live streamed everything. Live streamed everything. Right. He killed everybody. That's crazy. But yeah, y'all want to join hand in hand, man. Give me Proverbs 16, 16. That's what is crazy. 16, join hand in hand. Yeah. Go Proverbs ahead. 11 and 21. Yeah, bring that up. Mark, you said Mark 13? Oh, yeah, Mark 13. Mark 13, yeah, start at like uh, 5. This, this is the book of Mark 13. Yeah, hold that. Bring that out real quick. Oh, this is the book of Proverbs. Chapter 11 and verse 21. Bring it out. Go hand, hand join in hand. hand. So join hand. Although hand join in hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished. You not getting away with this. Pull up in your nice little uh, Benzes and your police vehicles, right? Come, come shake our people hand, but you still not getting away with this. Because didn't they say that a federal agent Ford knew about this? Yeah, that's what I heard. So how the fuck do you think we on your side? They said that he was uh, talking to a federal agent before he, he did it, man. And he fucked his own to, grandmother, told, right? Told him to um, watch the live stream, man. his own grandmother. And he, uh, he gave him the game plan of what he was going to do, man. Okay. See, this is the... We playing with the we playing with the top double on the earth right now, man. We playing with the top double on the earth, man. That's what our people fail to realize. Our people love dancing with the devil, man. Right? Read on. Come reading on. It says, but the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. But the seed of the who? The seed, the seed of, of the, the righteous, righteous shall, shall be, be delivered. delivered. That seed is not talking about every seed. That seed is talking about Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And then dispersed amongst the 12 tribes of Israel, which is these people right here on this side. Those are the seeds of the righteous, man. Not nobody else could be from that seed line. Right? Go ahead. Give me that, Mark 13. This is the book of Mark, chapter 13, verse 5. Bring it out. Take heed unless any man deceive you. Take heed to what? Take heed to this truth. Give me her back in chapter 2. Hold that right good. Give me her back in chapter 2 verse 2. Take heed unless any man deceive you, man. Right? Give me that her back in 2 and 2 real quick. Where we get it? Back in chapter 2 verse 2. Bring it out. And the Lord has me that said, write the vision and make it plain upon a table. And that's that scripture, man. The Lord said, write the vision and make it plain upon tables, right? That it says, don't be deceived, right? Go ahead. That he may run that readeth. And what did that mean? He may run that readeth it. What did that mean? When the Bible says, he may run that readeth it. Run from what? Run from iniquity, man. When you make it plain upon tables, right? In order to not be deceived, right? You make it plain upon tables so that man can run. Read that again. Because ah, you want to run from iniquity. Go ahead. And the Lord unto me 
And the Lord after me has said, write the vision and make it plain upon table. Make it plain upon table so even the simple ears can understand. Right? Go ahead. That he may run. That he may run. He's going to run from iniquity. Go ahead. That read of it. That read of this. Right. Because if you got a, a brain in your head, you're going to say, yo, if this is what the Lord wants for me, why the fuck am I playing games? 